Safety and peace, Altair. You're in my way. Yes, Al Mualim has asked that I assist you. Remind you how it is we hunt our prey. I know how it works. Be that as it may, I have no desire to disobey. Then be quick. The Assassin have many tools at their disposal. Yes, yes. We can eavesdrop, we can pickpocket, or we can use violence to intimidate. Good, you remember. So you'd have me walk amongst the others and learn what I can about the traitor? Yes. Begin by going to the village market. That's where we first spotted the traitor. You know who it is? Perhaps. Then give me a name and let's be done with it. That's not the way it works. Now go. And remember, begin your search in the village market. I know what I saw. Musun opened the gate. He let the Templars in. Then you must tell Al Muallim. I can't. Masun did not act alone. Someone inside the fortress helped him. What makes you say this? He exchanges letters with someone inside. The basket weaver carries them for him. That's no reason to stay silent. Ah, but the weaver delivered him a letter just before the attack. I suspect it held the order to open the gate. Then speak to the Weaver. He can name Masun's accomplice. He's disappeared. Hiding for fear of being dragged into this. <laughs> Probably inside one of his own baskets. One, we lost everything in the attack and have no place to store our grain. I I can't right now. I'm busy. Is this about the letter? What letter? The letter you received when I got here. Bad news? I, I don't know what you're talking about. Listen, I'll see what I can do, but please, I need to be alone right now. Come back later. As you wish. It's Al Mualim who's betrayed us. Now. You'll see. Soon, all your eyes will be opened to the truth. We stand upon the threshold between this world and a new one, a better place where all might live as equals. But men like Al Mualim would see this dream destroyed. Two days' attack was but the first, and more will follow unless you repent. Give up your wicked ways. Rise up against the madman of Masyaf. 
See through his lies! Quickly then, I have no interest in your games. Why did you betray us? And who do you serve? We serve the Templars. You should too. Their cause is just. We? Jamal, he told me of their plans. Asked me to open the gate. You betrayed us. We, who called you brother and kept you safe from harm. I did what I believed was right. And if you must kill me for it, so be it. I am not afraid to die. Your fate is not for me to decide. It's Al Muallam who will judge. Fast forwarding memory to a more recent one. You stand accused of betraying our brotherhood and opening the way for our enemies. How do you answer to these charges? I deny nothing. I'm proud of what I did. My only regret is that they failed. I offer you a chance to repent, to renounce the evil in your heart. It is not evil in my heart, but truth. I will not repent. Then you will die. You did well, Altair, and have earned the right to carry a blade once more. What will become of the one who helped him? It remains to be seen. Some do ill out of ignorance or fear. These men can be saved. Others suffer from corrupted wills, their minds poisoned and twisted. These men must be destroyed. Soon enough, we'll know what sort of man Jamal is. I've passed your test, then. What now? <laughs> oh, my child. We've only just begun. I hold here a list. Nine names adorn it. Nine men who need to die. They are plague bringers, war makers. Their power and influence corrupts the land and ensures the Crusades continue. You will find them. Kill them. In doing so, you'll sow the seeds of peace, both for the region and for yourself. In this way, you might be redeemed. Nine lives in exchange for mine. A most generous offer, I think. Have you any questions? Only where I need begin. Very well. Ride for Damas. Seek out the black market merchant named Tamir. Let him be the first to fall. Be sure to visit the city's assassin bureau when you arrive. I'll dispatch a bird to inform the Rafik of your arrival. Speak with him. You'll find he has much to offer. If you believe it best, I do. Besides, you cannot begin your mission without his consent. What nonsense is this? I don't need his permission. It's a waste of time. It's the price you pay for the mistakes you've made. You answer not only to me, but all the Brotherhood as well now. So be it. Take your equipment and go. Prove that you are not yet lost to us.
Altair, it seems my students do not fully understand what it is to wield the blade. Perhaps you could show them what you know. Shark carriers can easily break your cover. Thank <laughs> you. 
Stop this man!
When the Animus shows you are being watched by an informant, to be a true hero. These are dark days indeed. There's they nothing I do not have. And must be made to Come, pay. have a look. You won't be show you everything I have. You 
something to say. Have your head. <laughs> 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 along when you did. Another minute and they would have made off with me. I owe you my freedom. between Damascus and Jerusalem. But recent business had been poor. It seemed there were none in Jerusalem who wanted what he had, fruits and vegetables from nearby farms. As Tamir drove his caravan north, he came across the Saracen leader and his starving men. Most hmm. fortunate for them both, each having something the other wanted. As Tamir drove his caravan north, he came across the Saracen leader and his starving men. Most fortunate for him, each having something to None know the man better than I. Come close, hear the tale I have to tell of a merchant prince without peer. None know the man better than I. Come close. Hear the tale I have to tell of a merchant prince without peer. Some say, were it not for Tamir, Salahadin's men would have surely turned on him. Could be we won the battle because of that man. Quite a bit about Tamir. Tell me what he's planning. I know only the stories I tell, nothing more. A pity. There's no reason to let you live if you've nothing to offer in return. Wait, wait! There is one thing. Continue. He is preoccupied as of late. He oversees the production of many, many weapons. What of it? They're meant for Salah ad Din. This does not help me, which means it does not help you. No, stop, listen! Not Salah Eddin. They're for someone else. The crests these arms bear, they are different, unfamiliar. It seems Tamir supports another, but I know not who. Is that all? Yes, yes. I've told you everything I know. Then it's time for you to rest. <laughs> Something? Will know of your sacrifice. 
Altair, it is good to see you, and in one piece. You as well, friend. I am sorry for your troubles. Think nothing of it. A few of your brothers were here earlier, in fact. Oof, if you'd heard the things they said, I'm certain you'd have slain them where they stood. It's quite all right. Yes, you've never been one for the creed, have you? Is that all? I'm sorry. Sometimes I forget myself. What business brings you to the mass? A man named Tamir. Al-Muallim takes issue with the work he does. I meant to end it. Now tell me where to find him. Should we you remember how to track an enemy? Of course. Learn where he will be and when. But that sort of work is best left for... I understand. Go and search the city. Determine what he's planning and where he works. Preparation makes the victor. What can you tell me of him? Tamir makes his living as a black market merchant, so the Souk district should be your destination. I would suggest you seek out the following places. A small souk northeast of here, the Madrasa to our east, and in the gardens north of this bureau. Focus on these places and he should become well known to you. I assume you want me to return to you when this is done? Yes. Come back to me. I'll give you al Mualim's marker and you'll give us Tamir's life. As you wish. Remember, Altair, if you find yourself in trouble and the city turned against you, return to the Bureau. I can shelter you from the storm. Be warned, though. If your enemies are too close, my door will remain closed until you've lost them. Do you understand? Yes. To bring the enemy inside would compromise the Brotherhood. Very well. Off you go. Peace. 